I'm gonna teach you three secrets on what you should do to never blow your trading account ever. Learning these three secrets is gonna enable you to stay in the forex market for months, even years, if you just take note on what I'm gonna be revealing. So imagine if you are able to trade and you are experiencing losses, but at the same time, your account is never blown. How much better would your trading be? These three secrets are simple tricks that's gonna be able to help you stop seeing losses and start seeing profits. If you are the person that wants to see profits on a weekly, daily, and even monthly basis, you'd be able to do that with these three secrets that I'm gonna be revealing with you. But if let's say now you won't be taking notes of what I'm gonna be saying, then I, I encourage you to stop watching the video. But if you are a person that's gonna implement on this, then yeah, it's okay. Let us continue to dig down on these secrets that I'm gonna be I'm sharing with you. But at the same time, I want you to know that, as I said, there are basics. So if you have heard them somewhere, I'd like you to listen to them or encourage you to listen to them with an open mind. Okay, now I'm gonna start off first with the first um secret. So what happens is that if you take a look at it, I believe it's something that I have already spoken about it. You do have a big win. And you do have a small win. With that being said, it means that um you have a big loss and a small loss. Okay, so now with this, I'm gonna be able to show you what it does to your equity curve. So what happens is that all these trades are what you get in the market now, but all you have to do is just cut off one, which is cut off the big loss. So what it simply helps you with is that it helps your equity. Let's say you start off first with zero dollars now your equity curve is going to start moving like let's say if you, you keep on experiencing losses it's going to be going like this and just small wins like this and a big win and then it'll be like this now it'll keep on going like small wins small losses small wins small losses and a big win and small wins small losses just like this that's what it helps with but if let's say you do experience let's say i'm um, big losses it'll do something like big loss and then like this and then just a big win and then like then a big loss do you get that like it's not a constant number so when i keep on going up even though it's not like shoot all the way upwards but then move upwards in a steady manner so this is the first secret so now i want us to dive onto the second secret which i'm gonna draft it out this side so with this one here is that you have to um stick to a specific risk meaning that um whatever that you're trading whether it's a big or small account you have to stick to a specific risk meaning that whether you're risking um one percent okay one percent or two percent it means that whenever you experience a loss it has to be that risk meaning that um even if let's say now you're using two percent even if you experience 10 losses out of your whole trading account it's going to be negative 20 percent it's gonna be negative 20 percent now and one thing that's amazing about this is that let me just give you a quick example if you've got let's say a thousand dollars a thousand dollars here you're trading with a thousand dollars and now you're down 10 trades which it's very rare if you've got a if you've got a strategy that works but you've got 10 trades that went against you and you're losing um two percent which is like now 20 percent you're 20 percent down meaning that your account is now on 200 i mean you are 200 dollars down your account is now on 800 us dollars okay so meaning that if you still get to risk 2% per trade, it's now it, it will be 2% of the whole 800 US dollars, which means which means that it's it's no longer um the same one. Let's say now 2% of a thousand dollars, it's much more different to 2% of 800 dollars, meaning that you'll never get to blow your account using this method. Because even if you're on 10 dollars, you're still risking 2%, which is like what two dollars or something, like, not even two dollars, 20 cents or something like that, you know. But um, this is what you have to do. You have to just keep on risk, um, sticking to the same risk. That is secret number two. Now I want us to just finish off with the last secret, which is the third one. And this one here is that it's very much important because this is what's going to be able to make you, um, not only just stay in the market, this is going to be able to make you stay in the market for years and, and all of that. But this one is going to be able to just every month, your equity cap keeps on going upwards. And what is it? Um, it is to actually look at the risk to reward. Whenever you're risking one, you should be able to gain um three, or more okay meaning that if you risk if your one is two percent whenever you're risking two percent you should you should aim to gain at least six percent or more meaning that even if let's say now you have ten trades net ten trades and out of the whole ten trades what happens is that you experience five losses net five losses and even five wins and even five wins You've lost um out of um five losses you're risking two percent which makes it um somewhere around ten percent so you lost ten percent because it's five times two ten percent 
So now I'm um, let's say now your reward is three. Whenever you risk one, your reward is three. So now you won five trades. So it is five times three, which makes it a number like fifteen percent. You lost this, lost, and you won fifteen percent. So basically, if you just take a look at the risk to reward, what it does is that it enables you to be able to just keep on making profits, whether you you win or lose the same amount. Because if you take a look at it, you lost five trades, you won five trades. But now you your percentage in profit is like fifteen percent. Your percentage in losses is like ten percent, which makes the net um percentage be five percent. Okay, five percent. This is amazing because what happens is that you lost five times, you won five times, but you're still in profit of five percent, which makes it amazing. Because even if whatever account that you've got you'd still be able to make consistent profits. But not only that, the most interesting thing about it is that once you do have a, a strategy that works um, in a much more better manner, like I said, my strategy is I won't lose five times and win five times. Instead, I'll win seven times and lose three times. And with the same amount of risk to reward, I'll just be able to just make more profits. Because let, let me just give you a quick example here. One last example. Let's say um, my strategy, the way that I treat me. Seven wins, seven wins, and three losses, man. Right? Three losses, I lose two percent per loss. So it's um two times it's six percent. I'm down six percent. But whenever it's two percent times um two percent whenever I'm in profit, so it's three multiplied by seven, okay? Because I'm risking one to gain three. So it's twenty-one. Whenever I win, I am I'm now twenty-one percent, twenty-one percent when you look at this. So out of like the whole ten trades, if you just take a look at it, um my whole equity curves, it gives me to something like I'm now on 15% out of just 10 trades that I'll be taking. So each and every 10 trades I make is over 15%, which is amazing about this. But these are the three secrets that I wanted to share with you guys. The first one, you just have to cancel out the big loss. You have four types of trades. You have to cancel out the big loss. The second one, you have to just um continue sticking to the same risk. Never be believing a setup too much and then you risk too much on it. That's what's going to keep you. So if you just stick to the same risk, and the third one, you have to always um, risk more than, I mean, you have to, your reward should be way more than what you're not even two times, but three times. I'd like to thank you so much um, for watching this video here, yeah, because um, I believe that it will help you be able to just make consistent money in the markets. Because if you take a look at it, uh, most people are struggling with this. They've got the strategy, but they're just struggling with this. So I just revealed something that was able to help me and my students be able to just keep on making money daily, weekly, and even monthly. So please, if you're a beginner, don't be intimidated by this. As if you keep on watching this video, you're going to be better at it. But I'd like to thank you so much, and I'll see you. I hope to see you in the next video. It's your boy, Lissi Bamutubi.